Yeah. 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 Okay, so uh, maybe you want to put it up? Okay. Like that? Okay, so lofting. Lofting built in the loft. It's more of a, it's more of a contemporary style of house. Oh. So if house is a lot of footwork and... Can you close that door? Close the door. Close the door. So if footwork is... If house is a lot of footwork and stuff that's standing up, loft is a little wider mm. we take a longer time to express ourselves mm. or we use longer and bigger moves to express ourselves um like if you see ballet it's like that 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 you know this this uh this position this position this position and loft is like yeah, it's, it's, it's like Longer. it's like it's like taking a bucket of water and just throwing it on the floor. It's splash. It's not it's not drop by drop by drop. It's splash. It's all over the place. So so you know you know how a sentence. So when you put words together and it makes a sentence. sentence. Yeah, 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 okay, I know. But a whole story is what we call a paragraph. Mm. So, house is a sentence, yeah. and loft is a paragraph. So, we're going to tell a whole story. We're not just going to do short uh, words. I mean, they're both, they're, both, they're, both, they're both two sides of the same coin. It's house. But you have people that do house this way, and then you have people that do house on a loft way. Uh, a lot of people think that lofting is a little more advanced because we do a lot of floor moves and we do a lot of gymnastics and stuff like that. So, but house dance can be just as difficult. It's just, um, it's how you want to express yourself. If you want to express yourself in a very short way, then you have house. Boom, 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 boom. Ba, 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 ba. Bam. But. Like your style is more. My style is more loft. Longer. My style is longer. Yeah. Okay, so you see how you write letters in English? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We have a way called cursive, which okay. is script. Script. So okay. script is a bit more. Continue. Continue. Right, so. You look at letters, I'm using a lot of academic comprehensive, but if you look at letters, the way you write letters, the way you write letters in English, yeah. you can write in a way that everybody can understand. That's what house is, you can dance in a way that everybody understands. But then you have what's called cursive, which is script, and it's a little fancier, it's a fancy way of writing. Huh? Add your flavor or add your style. Well, no, you add your style and you add your flavor anyway. Mm. But the the boat. <laughs> I'm using a lot of uh, analogies. The boat that it, it's like house is a boat. Yeah. Right. You know how there's different boats. You have a canoe. Mm, I, I need to. You have a rowboat. Yeah. And. And you have you have a rowboat, and then you have a motorboat. Yeah. Um, wow, is that a way to put it? <laughs> it's like you have a sailboat. Okay. And you have and you have a a rowboat. Okay. So a rowboat is like house. You're using your power. Okay. Uh, and you're going in the direction that you want to go. Whereas. The sailboat is like lofting, where you put up the sail and the wind takes you oh, okay. anywhere that you want to go. Cool. That's a good way of saying it. Cool. So um, it depends on how you it depends on how you want to how you want to express yourself, how you want to dance. Um, some music makes you do things very short. Short short and finish quick and some music makes you dance for a long time 
you're writing a whole story. There's a lot of pages. Oh, okay. You understand? Yeah, understood. Thank you. Yeah?